so we're back at the Sneed Arms. Um, if you've seen the first video, you'll know that we had loads of activity here in the, inside the pub area, behind the bar. Rempog going, cat ball going, footsteps, footsteps, clear as day, clearest we've ever heard. We didn't get to do this part last time, did we? No. This is what they call the Knights Templar Bar. There's been loads of reported activity in here. James is going to take us around in a moment, and he's just going to explain a few things to us, what's been going on, and then we'll get into it, mate. Yeah, yeah. Me, exactly. Hopefully it's a good Hopefully night. Hopefully it's a good night for you again, guys. We've done a lot of work in here, so we might have stirred something up. A lot of the staff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ollie's himself, he's said about hearing noises and stuff. Danielle, who works here, that door that's at the bottom, we seems to open. Um, on command as well, actually, for her, which she didn't like. But yeah, so it, it, it just, again, it seems a little bit different in here. It's always quite funny because we decided to put the electrics here, so when they turn the lights off, so at the end of the night, you see them be switched off and then you see a little torch light run down as if they're running out to get out. <laughs> So they're always trying to rush out, get out the staff off, which is quite funny. But yeah, so the next bit obviously for renovating is obviously the back. So we're gonna, I'll show you upstairs, and obviously again it's completely derelict back. Again, excuse, excuse the balloons and trip hazards. Someone's finding this 21st. There's a few trip hazards as well. anything in particular that caught me out but now I feel like a little bit last time I was here James yeah I come up here and, and everybody went downstairs I won't forget the cat ball and I swear I, I felt as if someone's really watching me mate honestly yeah just dead weird it does it does seem very different up here and I yeah. think stirring up a lot of the the building a lot of weights because they have done stuff up here because they've obviously we've We've got to have fire systems, obviously fire alarms throughout the building. So obviously the smoke detectors in here now. Um, even though we're not using it. Um, but no, like me now I feel short bit short of breath. I'm the same now. Oh honest. And I don't I don't understand but I never used to feel funny up here. Where now if if I do come up here I do tend to like be like, oh Ollie Keenan, I will lift something out. I don't I haven't been in here on my own. The only thing is here as well, there's no, within the pull box you've got fridges, you've got stuff that can make certain clicking yeah, noises and stuff like that, yeah. in here you're not going to have that. No. Obviously you've got to take in consideration obviously maybe little bits of creaks and stuff, but yeah, in yeah, here, actually, yeah. like you just heard then, like it's, yeah. it seems too quiet. <laughs> too quiet, isn't it? But yeah, so this is quite a, an interesting room which will be fun for you yeah. Mark on your own, I'm sure. I think that would be good, uh, good entertainment. Yeah. <laughs> I do know that there's the part of the building here, so one of the cottages at the back of two, because if you look through the next bit there, you can actually see a doorway. Yeah. So if you go through here on the right, on this wall, there, there, they've obviously bricked the doorway up. Yeah. So obviously, the, there is another yeah. element to the building. I don't know when that was build it up and then in the cellar area that we've created you can actually go through the loft bit and again there's another room that would have gone through to there so they basically there's another like there yeah there's another two rooms <coughs> right and obviously there would have been a room there obviously so i don't it was obviously even bigger than what it it is now like you say a lot of this obviously is just slowly renovated this is a new roof we put on top of this because obviously this needs it needs to go but it's Room wasn't built in a day. Wasn't it? Well, if you want to go through here, shall we pull? Excuse the mess, but well, obviously. So this is like the thing on the chair graveyard. And then well, obviously again we put power in here, so whatever's potentially. And then 
a missing part. This is the original four. That's what I mean, it's the original. That's right. Now it's a different, totally different. Yeah, yeah. and obviously we're directly below, but like, yeah, where we were, sort of thing. So, but there has been a lot of, like I say, you can see the vice set. So we've we have done some drilling with banging. There has been some work done in here, but yeah, it's uh, and then that other room is just behind you. Well, yeah, let's go through there. Right. It, well, obviously that's just a story. It's pretty much exactly the sort of same size. But in that room there's a fireplace and there's actually windows, but they've been bricked up from the outside. I'm assuming that's from the cottages because the cottage is back onto this. Um, so you meant this. What no, like I say, it's got some serious character. Definitely. Oh, the floor. I don't even I wouldn't I wouldn't do anything with that. Uh, yeah. Keep it like that, I would. <coughs> yeah, I'd probably say that is probably the original. Could be. The, there is the church across there is believed to be obviously what the foundations of their church yeah so the the actual if you google it the knight's temple were believed to be on this location in the area so what's to call this the knight temple obviously i can send you a photo paul if the upstairs <coughs> window from the, the pub yeah which is obviously for me people make their own assumptions of it but i'm adamant it looks like someone in armour and I'm, nice. I'm adamant obviously when we think I'll show you in a minute yeah, it's, I was sat on the step there looking up I was buffering and I actually thought it was the other half I was thinking why is she watching me <laughs> I, well, I'm just buffering the floor and I took it and I took another one directly after and it's in the one photo not in the other so it's a uh, and people have said actually I'll leave it so people can comment and think what it, yeah, yeah. what it is and the thing is but I have my opinion it's a night but there's been two direct other things that have been said it looks like and obviously everyone's perception is different isn't it? but yeah if, I think we could have potentially stirred something up by calling it the temple above just because if they were here and obviously I think you've seen the well at the back yeah yeah it's um, acceptable when we come into now that well from mine is yeah and there's an archaeologist from the uni and he's adamant uh, that there's He's basically saying there's two other wells on the car park, okay. one at the entrance there yeah. and one obviously where there's like a bit of a water pump. So why would you have in one location three wells? It's got to have been an important location yeah. before it was a pub. So yeah, it was uh, interesting. So potentially renovating, shaking it up a little bit, still keeping the exact same, the build, obviously we've not built all Done anything with the brickwork or anything like that. Like you say, so it's uh, yeah. I think we've definitely rocked the boat a little bit. It's fine now, it? Yeah, it's fine now. Are you still here with me? Thank you. What about the red light? Could you make the, the red light light up more colours, please? Are you a male? A boy? Thank you. Are you a child? A small boy? jump then that's just a fridge behind me guys so ignore that again great activity with the REM pod and K2 on command guys 
So you're not a boy? Are you a man? An adult? Could you touch those lights for me if you're a man? Thank you. Great responses once again, guys. I think the noises behind me are just the fridges. I'm gonna ignore that even though they are, just, <laughs> they are making me jump. Thank you so much. Did you used to work here? Thank you. And this used to be a stable, didn't it? Where you kept your horses. K2. Thank you very much. I just felt you here. Definitely just felt you here. Thank you. Just as I said, guys, blast the cold air. I'm still feeling it right now. The K2 lit up. Thank you so much. I can definitely feel your presence here. I really do appreciate that. Could you move something in here, please? You can. All the way to orange, thank you. Could you move something for me then, please? So I can hear it. What about this ball? As you can see, it flashes just like those other lights. If I roll it to you down there, could you move it for me? K2, thank you. Could you push that back to me please? Use all of my energy. Oh guys, it's gone really quiet. Some great responses once again, and I actually felt that ice cold blast again. I can't, I can't explain it enough to you. But like I've said before guys, it's feelings that we get that we can't express to you only, you know, we can only tell you what we're feeling. And you choose whether to believe it or not. I can tell you 100% guys that I've felt this ice cold blast, it's, it's like nothing I've ever felt before. I'm going to leave now, I would love you one last time to touch those lights before I go. Could you do that for me please?
Just one last time. And then I'll leave. Wow, thank you. See now, I know that electric and stuff, that you know, this fridge is even that, that will set K2s off guys, I'm not gonna lie. The K2 is in the center of the room and it's only going off on command when I ask for it to go off. So, you know, there is that. It's not constantly going, you know what I mean? If it was constantly going, I'd be questioning it, definitely. But I've had the feelings as well, guys. The ice cold blast, the feelings. And when you put all that together, what can you say? It's not a coincidence. It's been great in here. And it does really put you on edge. I can see why Danielle runs out of here, the girl who actually works here. There was something that became so obvious after watching the footage, but at the time, I didn't realise. And I'll show you the two clips in a moment. But the fridge fans, when they kick in, the K2 meter triggers. I mean, that doesn't take away the feelings I was getting at that moment in time. But looking at it from an investigator's perspective and a sceptical perspective, I think that it could have been the actual fridges um, setting off the K2 meters. I'm going to replay those uh, clips back to you now and see what you guys think, but I'm saying that it is actually the fridges triggering the K2s. Could you touch those lights for me if you're a man? Thank you. Great responses once again, guys. Just one last time, and then I'll leave. Wow, thank you. Is there anybody here with me? Could you make a noise for me? on my own as you know if you're watching me could you please make a noise for me please I don't want to be harmed you can see a red light over there is there any chance you could press it for me won't harm you Come on, come and join me. Just make a noise, please. I 
I tell you what guys I've got a feeling it's oh I can't describe it it just feels though I want to run I want to just run out of here I am really really scared come on make a noise for me you'd have to be here to realize what it's like honestly Please come and join me. I don't know what to say to you only if you are watching me could you make one of these lights flash could you make a tapping noise even a whistle <whistles> like that come on please make a noise for me I know you're here Are you here, Joseph? Joseph, I'm asking you to come and join me. saying it but good god come on joseph just come up the stairs to me don't be afraid This little boy's here. You gonna make a noise for me, mate? Come on. I'm getting a draft. Oh. Is that you making me go cold? Please come and join me. Make any kind of noise, I don't mind. As long as you don't hear me. love you show yourself if you could do that It'd be amazing I think you can hear rain at the top
Don't stand by, it keeps getting bullied. I'll ask you again, Joseph, or anybody apart from Joseph who's watching me or who can see me. Please make a noise. My stomach, sorry guys. If you're downstairs, could you make a noise? Can you hear me? Come on, make a noise for me. Could it be possible you could whistle? There's a red light at the top of the stairs. Could you make it flash for me? You did it down below. Did it downstairs. I'm sorry I'm asking you all these questions. I just want to, you know, to know that you're here with me. So please make a noise, make anything flash. I would appreciate it. I'm sorry again for asking questions. After question, after question. I must be getting on your nerves because I'm getting on my own nerves. <laughs> Come on, please make a noise. I suppose you're in bed, I suppose, that's time and out. Well, morning. <sighs> quiet, guys. Surprisingly quiet. But surprisingly eerie. Be honest. When the face come up here, <clears throat> I was um, strange feeling as though I was being really watched, and that I was really scared. But um, now I've just started calm down a bit. Come on, make a noise for me, please. Make that red light flash different colours. It's not happening, guys, I don't think. Can you knock? quiet. 